This is Math 99, prom, practice test number three, problem number four. We're supposed to create a system with infinite number of solutions. I had also said that we need um, two equations, two variables, and it also said that um, the coefficients can't be the same. So I can't just write, you know, x plus y and x plus y. So I can create anything that I want. So I'm just going to make up an equation. So let's say I had 3x minus y equals 7. So now if I want there to be an infinite number of solutions, that means that um, basically my other equation is just going to be like a multiple of this. Because what I want to happen is everything to cancel out when I, when I add them together or, or when I substitute in or whatever. So if I were to take this and say, um, I don't know, multiply it by negative 2. So I'm just going to go this times negative 2 to create my other uh, equation. So uh, 3 times negative 2, negative 6x. Negative y times negative 2 would be plus 2y. 7 times negative 2 would be negative 14. That would work right there because they're the, they're the same line that would give me an infinite number of solutions.